Hello there, my name is Tracy Elsom and I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator based in Canada and welcome to my Paper Craft With Me YouTube channel. Today I want to show you uh, a little magic using an embossing folder. It's a new embossing folder from Stampin' Up! It's called Stone and it's only available for free during celebration which runs from January 3rd to March 31st and you actually get it for free alongside this pretty stamp set and to get those all you need to do is to place an order for 120 Canadian dollars before shipping and taxes and you can choose this bundle for free. Now a few days ago I created this bookmark and it used some paper and I just used the images from here but I thought I would show you the embossing folder separately so it's a 3d embossing folder just looks like that and I have a little bit of magic to show you so first of all I'm going to start with a piece of smoky slate card and I have smoky slate ink pad and what I'm going to go do to start is just tap the sponge on the ink pad and tap it over this piece of card and it's just to take away that sort of solid very boring single color that's there so there we go that's the smoky slate now i'm going to use a crumb cake ink pad i'm going to do exactly the same thing just and there's no rhyme or reason just add a little bit of ink just over this piece of card give it a little bit of dimension there you go not half as boring as it was when it started now I'm going to take the card and I'm going to place it inside the embossing folder and if you feel the embossing folder one side seems quite smooth and one side is a lot a lot more textured um, and you have the Stampin' Up! logo on the front so what I want to do is to put this inside with my inked side upwards inside the folder and because it's a random design you don't have to line it up with anything to make sure it's nice and straight so I'm going to bring in my big chop machine but let's do it this way it'd probably be easier to use okay so I have a standard big shot platform because this is a 3d embossing folder I'm going to put that directly onto the platform and now I have the new 3d embossing plate and this is slightly thicker than normal um, cutting plates and embossing plates because that embossing folder is thick and there's no pla um, plate underneath so all I'm going to do now is run it through and I'm going to run it back and this additional plate is available from Stampin' Up! via my online store so there we go so there is my card let's open it up and yeah it looks well not very much actually it, it, you know you look at it and you think okay so what's all the fuss so let me show you what the fuss is about I'm going to bring my smoky slate ink pad back in and my piece of sponge and this time I'm going to grab some kitchen paper just to stop myself from getting inky now this time instead of tapping on this piece of card you can see where I've, I've done a little bit of the tapping you can still see it this time I'm going to rub it in little circles and this is where the magic happens look at that I couldn't believe it once I started to ink up the embossed piece we still have a little bit of the tapped ink on there and it's gone inside some of these little grooves which wouldn't have happened otherwise so that's why I did that first but all I can say is this embossing folder is amazing I love it and you can see how some of the pieces are 
coming up a little bit darker and I'm not doing anything special it's just a little bit of smoky slate ink on smoky slate card and there you have it look at that isn't that amazing and it's all done with this embossing folder it's called stone and as I say you can get that for free during celebration from January the 3rd to March the 31st and I'll have more details on my blog along with a card that I'm going to make using that piece so I hope that's inspired you I hope it's made you want to get this particular embossing folder along with the coordinating stamp set but in the meantime I'm going to say goodbye thank you very much for watching and I hope you'll subscribe to my channel click the link below and then click on the little bell so that you get a notification and every time I post a new video that will come out alternatively or as well as you can also go to my blog at www.papercraftwithme.com where I'll post a project using this and also there's projects new projects posted every single day so thank you very much again for watching and I'll speak to you again soon Bye.